everybody, welcome to Making It Up, where we mix makeup and beauty with a wee bit of spooky. Sticking with the spooky theme today, everybody, as I have another gothic and alternative lifestyle subscription box unboxing for you all. This time, though, it is from Box of Goth. <laughs> Here we are. If you don't know about Box of Goth or what it is, I'm going to let you know now. So, this is a UK based, very, very small, one woman operation subscription box here in the UK. It costs £26.50 a month to receive, including your postage and packaging. Uh, and the items vary greatly. We get bits of makeup, we get ornaments, we get oil burners, we get incense sticks, um, we get the cutest little things as well. Well, I actually uh, chose to get um, the Box of Goth Advent Calendar last year. That was absolutely stunning and amazing. Uh, right, everybody, let's get into it and see what we've got for our goodies this month. Always does come in a coffin-shaped box, which I just think is well, it just appeals to my sense of humour, in all honesty. Um, here we This is what is inside, everybody. So, first things first, it looks like we've got a cushion or a plushie or something. Let's have a look. It's... Oh, it's so soft. Oh, it's so soft. It's... It's hard to describe. It's like, it's a really soft fleecy cushion material. Um, it's it's not f too fluffy or anything. A little bit more velvety maybe. Um, but yeah, it's in the shape of a cross. It's a beautiful burgundy, raspberry, purpley colour, pinky purple colour. Um, so that's absolutely awesome. I love that. <laughs> that says, that'll probably end up in my backdrop everybody. So keep your eye out for it. Um, then what have we got? Ooh, what's this? Oh, looks like a little cotton uh, sort of makeup bag or purse or something. Uh, let me, ah, yes, the natural choice Westford Mill. Um, the, do, 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 the other one that we got, um, now then, was that from Spooky Box or a Cult Box? And it's got a bat on it, the other one that I've got. Um, this one, as you can see, has got the rainbow on it with the sunshine underneath, which is very, very cute. And it says, a dead inside, which, again, appeals to my sense of humour. Uh, but we've got a wee sort of cotton makeup bag. They're a really good, strong quality. So, next item is something wrapped in a paper bag and it sounds like it might be jewellery go yes oh cool it's on um it's a little um oh, what's it called like laser cut coffin plastic uh coffin there we go or acrylic uh with the crucifix cut out in the middle there we go, that's better. And the chain it's on, it's uh, one of these um, that you'd normally get like dog tags on or whatever with uh, this sort of fixing. There we go, at the back. These are not my favourite, I have to say. Um, they're a bit fiddly for me, even though I've got wee fingers. But can I get it over? I might be able to get it over my head. Oh, yep, yeah, there we go. That's a really good length though, really good length. A wee bit longer than my pendants um, that I wear every day. Uh, but yeah, awesome little bit of uh, everyday fun jewellery. So that's great. Next item out of the box is again, wrapped in a wee bag and this feels so tiny. Crikey Moses, how oh, am I gonna get into this? Hang on. Oh, matching earrings. Wow, and these are coffin shaped as well, but these have got tiny little wee bats cut out of them. Right, I'm going to have to get these on. Bear with. Okay, so I've got the earrings in. How cute are these? I absolutely love them. I think it's, yeah. They have really cheered me up today and I'm gonna leave these on when I go and do the school run shortly. So, fabulous, thank you very much. We have earrings and matching necklace. Always like to get a set, don't you? Is it just me? Or, you know, anybody else like that with the, with the matching stuff? Shoes and handbags as well, I'm a nightmare for. Anyway, next item out of the bag, yet again in a bag. And let's have a look. Oh. 
Oh, right, cool. Oh, awesome. Again, another coffin necklace, but this is like uh, a cut through wire one, can you see? Um, but it's on one of these sort of leather cord type of necklaces, which personally um, I prefer my ones that I wear every day are on these. I find they last longer on me, in all honesty, and I'm less likely to be allergic to them. Uh, metal ones, if they're not uh, sterling, sil uh, sterling silver or stainless steel, um, I will start to get an allergic reaction, but hey ho, that's fine. Um, so lovely, another necklace there. And what else have we got? What else have we got? Uh, oh, is this our patch? <laughs> our patch this month says dead inside, the same as the uh, little make up bag or pencil case or knick-knacky bag. There we go. And um, what's this? It says, oh, Odd Coffin Plush. Ah, so, yeah. Uh, hi, my name is OC, or Odd Coffin. I'm odd because I may be a little off. I'm handmade by Nikki, and she's no seamstress. Wow, well, Nikki is the lady, is the one woman outfit who runs this subscription box. So she has handmade these. Oh my word for everybody, that's awesome. I'm squishy though, a bit like a stress ball. I also hold pins. All look good amongst other cushy friends. We're all a bit odd and we all need a hug sometimes. And just a little reminder of that. Love everyone dearly, much love always, Nikki and me. Nikki hasn't gone mad, promise, not promise. <laughs> I think you have, Nikki. That is, abs I absolutely love that. Um, we all do need something to have a cuddle up to every now and again. Um, and we are all a bit odd. Uh, we're all a bit bonkers and not quite, you know, straight round the edges kind of thing. Um, that's very much the community that we have here on uh, Making It Up along with several other channels as well which all their details are down in that description box where it says the authentic army that is of course miss lisa from beyond authentic miss becky with beauty with becky kiss kelly afflicted beauty and a few others please do go and check their channels and content out as well um they are such wonderful lovely people please do go and support them this is what we're all about we're all about um being supportive and inclusive uh, and just in encouraging each other rather than pulling each other down which can sometimes be the way uh, but we are here to book that trend so if that feels like a community you would like to become a part of please do hit the thumbs up button tell YouTube first of all that you are enjoying my content and also that subscribe button and the notification bell turn it on to all that way YouTube will tell you every time I upload a video which is around about twice a week right okay let's move on so we've just got a couple of more wee things in here. We have a <laughs> we have a little metal sign. I've got one up on my backdrop at the moment. It says 100% witch that also came from Box of Cop. But this one says straight out of coffin. I like that. I like that. Yep. Very, very pleased with that. Um, my husband and I, I have to say, uh, it's been a dream of ours to always build like um, a bar and things in our back garden and we're going to do it out of used pallets. Um, so I think I'm going to be saving all these up uh, just so people know whose bar it, it truly belongs to, you know, because we can't have anybody not knowing, can we? Let's face it. So I think I'll save that and uh, that might make an appearance in there one day. Then we have got, is this a sticker? This looks like a sticker, um, skeleton, and it's again, it says dead inside on it. That's quite a large sticker, actually. That's really cool, I like that. Uh, what's this? Oh, our pin badge, our pin badge is a skeleton laying down in a coffin, looking rather comfy, I have to say, with his hands behind his head and a bit of a, a blankie over there, keeping him warm on a chilly winter's evening. Um, so, fantastic. Awesome. Another pin badge to go with my collection. We have a couple of um, art print, or certainly one art print postcard this month. <laughs> and it's a skeleton peeking out of a coffin. Again, I use these on my backdrop and on my display. I have them all up on the back. So uh, that's another one to go into that collection. So, anything else? Oh, what's that? Hang on. Oh, 
this looks like a little magnet or something. It's a little wee coffin with, again, a crucifix cut out of it, but it looks like there's a little magnet or something on the back of there. I'm going to read through the cheat sheet in a minute and uh, and make sure we've got everything so we, hopefully it'll tell us on there what it is. Right, this is uh, the Coffin Club. There we go. So it's the Coffin Club. Um, that was the theme of this month. So we have the Coffin Club print by at Sin the... Oh, Sin These Art. There we go. Uh, I'm going to hold that up to the camera so you can see that Instagram name there, everybody. Okay. Um, so that's obviously uh, the featured artist for this month. Vamp coffin earrings. Absolutely. Dead inside case. Yes, absolutely. Odd coffin plushing mini. Yes, which is just so cute. And I have to say... Ooh, maybe the star item this month. We'll, ooh, we'll see. Um, acrylic coffin pendant. Yes, it was acrylic. Excellent. Dead inside embroidery patch. Absolutely. Coffin bezel wax cord, which is this necklace. Absolutely. Dead inside sticker by AJ Locasio. There we go, so that's that one. And again, I will hold the cheat sheet up with the name. Where is it there? Okay, that's the Instagram handle of the artist of the sticker. The coffin chilling enamel pin. Yes, I like that. The straight out of coffin tin sign. Absolutely. Um, so that's everything, isn't it? And I'm still no none the wiser as to what this is. Uh, like I say, I think it might be a little wee magnet. I'll have to try it on my fridge and let you know. So there we go, everybody. That is everything in the box of goth, the Coffin Club box. What do you think to it? What's your star item? Honestly, for me, I seriously think it's the earrings and the matching uh, necklace set and this cute little snuggle buggery. Um, I just think the time, effort, energy that has gone into that um, by Nikki, you know, the fact that she's got time to sit and the inclination to, to do that and to make those for everybody, as well as sourcing everything else that comes in the box, as well as putting the boxes together and getting them all shipped out. I'm in absolute awe, as always, of her work ethic, and uh, which is why I continue to support her, her wee up and coming business. So please do go and check her out yourselves. Thank you for watching, everybody, as always. Please let me know all your thoughts, feelings, and feedback are down in that comment section below. Um, I don't just do these sorts of unboxings. I have some beauty subscription boxes that I unbox. I do makeup looks, makeup hauls, collaboration videos. And of course, I do have my weekly live stream, the Friday Night Matter at 8 p.m. UK time. Please do come along, grab a drink, grab a chair, get yourselves nice and comfy. It's a really, really lovely, friendly, open-minded, encouraging, supportive, inclusive, friendly space for you to just come and have a chinwag and start relaxing into the weekend. Um, we literally talk about anything and everything. Um, it often ends up with me in fits of giggles, so if you fancy tuning into that, please do come along, say hi in the live chat. We would love to welcome you there. Other forms of social media you can follow me on. Um, Lisa and I from Beyond Authentic, we do have a joint Facebook page uh, and that is for you, the community, to interact with each other, promote yourselves if you're a fellow creator of any sort um, or share your knowledge if you know about up and coming product releases or sales that are happening, that is the place to let everybody know over there on Facebook. Also, I am on Instagram. Uh, the details of that will be on screen for you now, everybody. That's where I post about my uploads and if I'm requiring any help from you um, regarding upcoming videos or anything like that, yeah, I post there first before YouTube, so well worth a follow on Instagram as well. Right, I think that's everything for today, everybody. Enjoy the rest of your day. Keep safe and well, and I shall see you in the next one. Bye!